Happy Resurrection Sunday, everybody. Continue on South Hamilton Road for one and a half miles. That's fine. So I'm going live on the ministry page. I've been saying for a while, I'm going to try my best to be more interactive on the ministry page. So hey, y'all, giving some people time to hop on. Happy Easter Sunday, Resurrection Sunday, however which you call it. I know some people have their preferences. Um, I just left church and I am filled up. I am happy. I am rejuvenated and energetic. We'll see if that lasts by the time I get home. Probably gonna take a good after church nap. Cause not only was I in the house of the Lord, not only was I worshiping, but I kind of helped lead worship. And now I know some of y'all who have ever worshiped with me know that um, I have a heart for worship, but maybe not the vocals, amen. Um, that the noise I make is joyful to the Lord, but maybe not joyful to those around me in the flesh. But it is okay <laughs> because um, the church that I am attending, my new church home is Expanding Visions Ministries. Um, and there is a group of ladies who they don't lead worship every Sunday, but for special occasions, they'll lead worship. And one of the women asked me, hey, Brandy, do you want to worship with us for Easter? And I'm like, oh, baby, you ain't never heard me sing. I have a good speaking voice, but not a good singing voice. Amen. Um, <laughs> but she pretty much said, don't worry about it. I know that you are a poet and a spoken word artist. We want you to perform one of your poems. So I was really excited. Um to do that i'm like, all right absolutely i'll you know in between a song i'll perform one of my poems i got the perfect one in mind this is gonna work perfectly i'm not gonna lie and say i wasn't a little bit apprehensive when they were when they told me hey we're gonna be singing behind you as you perform your poems i'm like again beat rhythm not musically inclined i wasn't really confident but to god be the glory it worked out very well i'm going to uh do my best tonight to post the video to my youtube and post it to the channels um it was just I can't put it into words but it was just it was divine worship I'm I'm grateful to have been a part of that um and I'm gonna share with you all the piece that I did it's crazy you'll see how well my poem um melds together with the song that they chose that was not by our design that poem I wrote back in January when there was another church that had uh, reached out to me to perform at their church for um, one of their services and through different reasons it didn't end up working out um, and what's crazy is you know most of, most of my poems I write out of what's happening in my life you know what I'm feeling what I'm trying to work through that poem was the first poem I wrote like on request I guess uh, it was the first poem they're like hey this is what you know our, our theme and our message is going to be can you write something I'm like, sure, I'll give it a shot. And I just been thinking about it. Like the times when I'm stepping out on faith and doing things that are uncomfortable for me and not my norm, it's been working out really well. So I'm gonna just keep trusting you, God. Um, but the poem I wrote, I wrote it for um, their New Year's Eve service. I was really excited and it, it fell through. And I didn't think much more about the poem. But when they said, hey, we want you to perform for Easter, I'm like, oh, I'll just use the poem. And the poem fits so well inside of the the, the song that they sung and i'm like that's nothing but you god like people gonna think that we planned and and, and fact and figured it oh, it was nothing but god but i just wanted to share that with y'all i will share the uh clipped video later today but if you go um on the expanding visions ministry facebook page we stream the service live so the whole performance is up there with the sermon check the sermon out too but that's it i love y'all i'll see y'all bye